hey everyone, we're outside the general manager's office. It's her first week on the job and we wanted to see if she'd answer a few questions for us. Come on. Hi Marcy. Do you mind? Let woman have a camera. <laughs> Do you mind if we ask you a few questions? No, sure. In my family, they dropped you on the steps of City Hall when you turned 18 and told you to get a job. Um, I started as a clerk typist. I think most people know that. I went into um, steam generation. I worked at Valley Generating Station as a steam plant assistant, a plant equipment operator, a, a uh, control room operator. Then I moved into electric system operations, or load dispatching, they call it. And it was a load dispatcher, a senior load dispatcher, an assistant superintendent, a superintendent of load dispatching. Then I took over the energy control center. Then I came downtown as a, kind of a junior division head, had transmission, fuel, construction. I made division head. We called it bulk power at the time. And uh, then I came in as the assistant general manager over uh, marketing and customer service. And then in 2000, the end of 2000 is when I moved to Anaheim. A lot of the jobs I have had have been, you know, the first um, female or the first woman. And so frankly, a lot of the novelty is, has really worn off. 35 years I've been in this industry. And I've learned a lot. I learned a tremendous amount in Anaheim. I've learned um, from a lot of the external experiences. And, and so I, I want to try to bring that back to this company. And I think that's probably more important to me than, than being the, the first woman. Though my dad, my gosh, if my dad were still alive, he would love it. The, uh, it would be a big deal to him and Grandpa. My dad was here. He was a senior communications electrician. Um, my uncle worked here. My grandfather was uh, a substation chief. This is like coming home for me. You know, I put 25 years in here, 24.3, the retirement office will tell you. Um, and I've always had a, an interest at some point in coming back. I want to spend some time reconnecting with the employees. You know, they're the strength behind this department. That's where the, you know, the rubber really meets the road. We've got to learn how to work across a range of likely different outcomes. So we need to develop that, that ability to be far more flexible and agile. I still think it's very important for people to understand um, the priorities, the reasons things are happening, to solicit input. So uh, we're going to be developing a variety of communication channels. So many things have, have stayed the same, and yet there's a, there's a continued level of energy, commitment. The people are incredible you know, what one would expect in this particular company. So it's fun to be back. It's exciting.